A Christmas miracle. Two little girls born with a very rare condition and told by doctors they would never walk again are given the best Christmas gift ever. We first brought you the remarkable story of the adorable children last year. Now finally, after undergoing a state-of-the-art operation, these little angels are having their dream of walking realized. These little girls are adorable medical miracles, just in time for the holidays. She is our miracle. Doctors said the girls would never walk and even recommended amputation. But here they are today, little Jade standing, taking her first steps, walking along the seashore. It's beautiful to see her walk. And Gracie, often running on the lush grounds of Mar-a-Lago, Donald Trump's famed estate in Palm Beach. It's a dream come true for her parents. It's the best kind of miracle. That's one that you pray for every day. Fox TV host Greta Van Susteren was there. I can't keep up with her. She hosted a fundraiser for the surgeon who saved the girl's feet and was inspired by how far the girls have come. Uh, is that to die for or what? Their amazing journey began last January. Baby Jade was born with a foot badly twisted backwards. One doctor's prognosis was grim. After he said amputation, my mind went blank, and I, I really didn't hear anything else he said. I think I just broke down into tears. Mom, Sheen and Sprayberry, and her husband, Ephraim, took baby Jade to St. Mary's Medical Center in West Palm Beach. She is scared. On the day of the surgery, there are anxious tears as Dad carries his precious little girl to the OR for the life-changing procedure. Probably the hardest thing I've ever done. Dr. Dror Paley has pioneered a limb lengthening procedure as an alternative to amputation. She will be able to walk, run, play, jump, do everything else. So it's, it's senseless to throw that foot away, in my opinion. The innovative surgery involves precise drilling of wires into baby Jade's bone. Then, Dr. Paley meticulously constructs a cage of metal rings and adjustable rods that will literally twist the foot into a normal position. After four hours, baby Jade is wheeled out of the OR and into recovery. Mom and Dad check out the device. Definitely Daddy's little girl. It's not hurting anymore. Little Gracie Burke had the same surgery. Just a few days later, she was already on the go. And I'm on ballerina, too. Each day, Gracie's dad adjusted the fixator rods a millimeter at a time, repositioning Gracie's foot. Yeah, wiggle, wiggle. The device is so strong, they can just walk on it. And, and now, she's just starting. She'll be running on this. Now it is almost one year later. The girls are dressed in their holiday best with matching shoes. Gracie helps little Jade learn to take her first steps. The girls take to the stage a joyous moment at any time made more special this holiday season. They truly are Christmas miracles. Merry Christmas. Gracie and Jade, you are both brave and beautiful. Both of the girls, by the way, will need at least one to two more surgeries. Baby Jade's parents wanted to share with us that for the very first time, little Jade is getting a tricycle.